Uh, and, and Claire and Mike, I want you to look at Donald Trump here. This was a victory speech, okay? Just, just take a look at this. And the guy melts down. Watch. Who the hell was the imposter that went up on the stage before and, like, claimed a victory? She did very poorly, actually. You know, we won New Hampshire three times now. Three. Three. We win it every time. We win the primary. We win the generals. This is not your typical victory speech, but let's not have somebody take a victory when she had a very bad night. I find in life you can't let people get away with bull****, okay? You can't. You just can't do that. And when I watched her in the fancy dress that probably wasn't so fancy come up, I said, what's she doing? We won. Did you ever think that she actually appointed you, Tim? And think of it, appointed, and you're the senator of his state, and she endorsed me. You must really hate her. <laughs> no, it's, uh, it's a shame. It's I, a shame. Uh-oh. I just love you. No, that's, <laughs> that's why he's a great politician. You have the very, the now very unpopular governor of this state. This guy, he's got to be on something. I've never seen anybody with energy. He's like a uh, hopscotch. We have beaten Biden. You could almost say, who can't? Who the hell can't? The man can't put two sentences together. And just a little note to Nikki. She's not going to win. She's not going to win. But if she did, she would be under investigation by those people in 15 minutes. And I could tell you five reasons why already. Not big reasons. A little stuff that she doesn't want to talk about. I don't get too angry. I get even. Here he goes. I mean, really? it's really. I mean, so, so here, really, you, you he's going to threaten her, huh? You talk about confession and projection. Okay. By the way, who can't beat Joe Biden? I'll tell you who can't beat Joe Biden. Donald Trump. Who didn't win New Hampshire twice, as Willie brought up last hour, when he claimed to win New Hampshire twice? Donald Trump. Joe Biden smoked him in New Hampshire. Uh, it, and uh, Claire, he does everything from... Uh, making fun of Nikki Haley's dress because he says it's probably not that fancy to, to talking about Nikki Haley. There's stuff she doesn't want to talk about. Here's a guy who got caught illegally giving payoff money to a porn star. Here's a guy that a judge in New York said raped E. Jean Carroll. Here's a guy already found guilty of fraud. Here's a guy who's under, who, who, who's been arrested for stealing nuclear secrets, who's been arrested for stealing secrets on our, 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 our war plans against Iran. I could go on and on, but I don't have time to list the 91 counts. Here's a guy, again, utterly shameless and utterly doomed to lose again in the fall. But the Republicans... The Republicans can't help themselves, can they? No, they can't. And, you know, I, I, I just think we have to keep reminding everyone, this guy's not well. Um, mm -mm. And, and what's up with the orange face? You know, yeah. I mean, has anybody, yeah. has anybody checked to see if, is he applying this cheap bronzer to his face in clumps at various times of the day and night? And does he not realize it makes him look like he's really unwell? He's a different shade every day. He's confused. He's angry. Um, it is. It, and by the way, cracks in the armor appeared last night. You know, according to Donald Trump, he's the incumbent. Right. He won last, in, four years ago. If you're the incumbent and you can't manage more than 50 percent of the vote in your own party, you are one weak sister. And it is not good for him that he did as poorly as he did, that polls were wrong. They said he was going to win by 20 or 30. He won by just over 10. Um, and frankly, there hasn't been a great enthusiasm. There haven't been a good turnout in either Iowa or New Hampshire. So I, I think, um, and Biden got a lot of data last night for those Republicans that will never vote for Trump, those independents who don't want Trump, and that's the key to the kingdom in this election, finding those moderate Republicans and independent voters. We're going to solidify the base. I'm confident of that. So um, a bad night for Donald Trump, really bad night. Speaking of the kingdom, 
your pin has not gone unnoticed. Uh, we'll, yeah. also, we'll talk about that in just a moment. We'll, we'll give you time to gloat about the Chiefs okay. in just a minute.